Alright, so the Nintendo Direct is about to start, because it's uh, one minute away on February 17th. It's the first one we are getting in regards to a full Nintendo Direct in almost two years now. You know, the, the rest have been just specific Directs or minis. And this is crazy, and I'm pretty excited, and I decided, okay, I might as well just watch it, and if I get like a good reaction, I'll just pretty much cut to the interesting bits of me reacting. And let's go. Bro, I literally haven't seen this graphic, like, in so long. <laughs> oh my god, they're bringing, <laughs> I don't know, Genshin Impact to the Switch. <laughs> I got an to join the oh, wait, what? Who? I don't know who this is. I thought they were promoting some, like, anime game. And I guess they are, but, like, honestly, I haven't bought any of the Smash DLC. And, um... I mean, I don't really know if I want to, but... Oh, okay, I'm kind of interested now. Who, who, who is this? <laughs> they always make every new Smash character, like, out to be so overpowered, make it look like, oh my god, it's, you gotta get this one. It's the best. You'll win every single fight ever. I don't know. Oh. It's a Xenoblade character. I played that game for five minutes. They're bringing Fall Guys to Switch. Um, a little bit late, but uh, yeah, I can see it. It's not even coming out till summer. Oh God. I'm not aware how alive the game is now, but I'm assuming it's going to be even more dead then. Pass. Why does every game just seem to be an RPG from Japan? I'm not trying to generalize, but that just literally seems to be the case. <sighs> Is this another RPG? <sighs> another RPG. Cool. Is that a new Monster Hunter? Now, I'm not like a huge fan of the series, but this actually is grabbing my attention right now. I can hear my uh, sibling freaking out about this in the background, it's funny. Hmm. You know, that's actually... Wow, that looks like a really cool Switch variant. And, um... Yeah, uh, I'm impressed as a non-Monster Hunter fan, honestly. That Pro Controller variant is also pretty cool. Bro! Mario Baseball, oh my gosh! Oh, there's like some cool multiplayer mode, okay. That's, that's kind of interesting, actually. Alright, I'm not gonna get it, but um, I think some people will be happy with that. Hmm, okay. That's cool, Tales from the Borderlands on Switch. I mean, cool. Whoa, they made an arcade collection? Yeah, that's, that's a great idea. I think that might catch on. A zombie game. Surprisingly, I'm not as interested as you all may think. This... Killing demons in heaven is already the game I'm the most interested in right now. Yeah, I I am not the target demographic for this game. I can tell you that much. Yeah, that game is not made with me in mind to purchase it. 3D Plants vs Zombies. They did it. Oh my god. Oh wait, I was I was joking. Wait, this is a thing. Well. I am also not interested. <laughs> Metopia. It reminds me of uh, Find Me on the 3DS. More RPGs. <laughs> Alright. I haven't played Animal Crossing in so long. Oops, my villagers don't like me anymore. Actually, warp pipes, being able to teleport across the island, that is really good. Wow. Free update. Alright. Let's go, Nintendo. Oh, yeah. Super Mario 35, 35th anniversary. Are we going to get, like, more stuff besides just that? I will eventually get this game, I think. Never played it. I also just am broke right now, so... Okay, another Mario game, I think. No, never mind. I don't... I don't think that's Mario. I spoke too soon. Let's go, another RPG! They just keep talking about this 
game and it's like the least interesting RPG yet. Uh. All right, something Star Wars. Okay. Star Wars uh, that, a competitive free to play online game. That, that's it. We got we got a title. Okay. Cool. So like an entire country just goes missing randomly. At the end of your journey, the battle for survival. I mean, this is one of the more interesting games um so far, but not one I'd like see myself purchasing. This game looks actually pretty cool, and they made it into a physical release. Looks like. DLC to Age of Calamity. That's good. That's cool. I have the first Hyrule Warriors and I never finished it, but I do like it. So that's something that kind of interests me. Oh yeah, they're making a Bravely Default too. That's cool. That's an RPG I can, I can allow. <laughs> what does this art style remind me of? Maybe the uh, 2D Plants vs. Zombies. <laughs> it's the same world now. It's canon. Apex Legends on Switch? I thought they were late with Fall Guys, but god damn! Wait... Are we getting Skyward Sword on Switch? Skyward Sword HD- alright. Let's go Nintendo. I like that. Oh my gosh, do we still have motion controls? Is this gonna be like a no pro controller game? Let's go. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna come. I, I I hope I have money by then. <laughs> Alright, one more announcement. Oh my god. I don't know what it is. Oh my god, but it's so good. It is it Splatoon? Splatoon 3, they're in the an apocalypse. Oh my god. Dude, I bought Splatoon 2 and I played it for like an hour. I should have just waited. Pain. This is taking a bit to like reveal the game. They haven't really shown any gameplay. They're just like, hey, look, they're on a train. Oh, wow, look, they're in a place. And it's not as populated, I'm gonna assume. I, I don't really remember what the Ink City or whatever looked like. Splatoon 3. All right, that's cool. I'm excited for the community. I think the Splatoon community is pretty cool. So I'm excited um, for them to be able to eventually play that. I'm sure it's gonna have a lot of new features and such. Wait, did I just see a hermit crab? <laughs> yeah, they're not gonna talk about gameplay. Eh, this is just an announcement trailer. 2022, yep, 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 that's fair. So that's it. Um, I don't know. My reactions were pretty pessimistic, but I hope entertaining nonetheless. Thank you for watching my reaction to the February 17th, 2021 Nintendo Direct. Uh, I'd say I'd, I would do more, but... Going off current patterns, we won't get another one until the very end of 2022. So yeah, peace out gamers.